Hey what's up everyone, today we'll try to replace the display for the model Dell Latitude 3410. Once you open the laptop you can clearly see that the display is completely broken. The customer said he had put a headphone and then closed the laptop that is why it is broken. So to open this display all you have to do is get a pry tool that is plastic or a metal also will work but we'll use the plastic because we don't want to leave any marks behind. So gently insert the pry tool within the bezel and the display panel and keep sliding and twisting until you are confident that it has already come out and try to take it out with your hand and slowly you can unlock all the locks and then take out the bezel this is called bezel so keep it aside now we'll try to remove the display from the display panel so since this model is completely different you'll have to use the pry tool there are no screws in this so just insert this metal pry tool i'm using this metal pry tool because it is very very thin and try to put in between the display and the display panel and then just try to slide so that all the gum and the glue comes out and do the same thing for the other side as well and uh, so the display should come easily as that so you can clearly see there are no notches no bezel in this and now we'll just unlock the lock which is there for the display by using the pry tool and unlock this so the display is out and once you take out the display try to read that barcode and put that barcode on your google and once you search in the google the first link that comes on the google just you'll have to click on that um, so you'll get the display specification so it is a full hd display 14.0 and 30 pin glossy so that is the specification for the display in case you do not know which display to order so once you know the display model you can order it since i've already ordered and it is already here it's the same display specification 30 pin 14.0 and we'll try to connect this and see if it works so just to make sure that it fits that it is actual display because many of them comes with the bezel and without bezel as well try to fit in within the display panel if it fits it's the exact display that you need in this also many types of display comes full hd hd 2k 4k so we have to put what is needed like what is given in the specification that was HD display so now we have put the pin and locked it as well and let's wait for it to switch on once we lock it we'll just put a little bit of tape on top of it just to secure it so that it doesn't loosen up later on and once we're done with that we'll just fit in the display within the panel and try to switch on and see and uh, so once we secure the display let's just switch it on and see how long it takes to switch on and if it is working properly yes it switches on and i actually confirmed with the display resolution as well it is the same resolution yes it switches on and now we'll have to fit the entire display with the display panel because this particular display actually comes with no notch and no bezel so there is no screw that we can tighten it so we'll have to secure it with a double tape and we have to use this double tape between the display panel and the display to secure it so that it doesn't fall off when you are using your laptop so it is very simple to apply just the double tape is all you have to do is take the double tape and apply it on the border where uh, the metal panel is and apply it and then the same thing on the other side as well uh, once you're done with that then the display should be fine once you're done applying on both the side uh, try to take out or cut the remaining sticker that was there and then you just have to peel off the upper uh, sticker that is there on the double tape and here gently place the display on the display panel and make sure you align it properly and press on all the sides that you actually put the gum and uh, this is the only place where you get to align it once you are aligned press on all the four sides take the bezel and then place it on the display panel and try to press on all the locks that you see just press gently and make sure that it is all locked properly and at the bottom you will have to press not with one hand both the hand use simultaneously and press on all the sides so even now it is not completely locked turn the laptop aside, laptop around and you can see that there is a gap there the panel on the bottom is not locked use a plastic pry tool and try to insert the pry tool and then press against that panel not too hard because you're going to damage the display as well so you can see you can see behind it is actually getting locked so once it is completely locked you will know that there is no more gaps on the display panel so once you're sure with that only then try to use the laptop once you're done with that open the laptop and try to see if there are any visible gaps between the bezel and the display panel everything seems to be fine as of now 
and let me just show you how the old display looks completely broken and this is how it looks and this is the new display which is working all fine thanks for watching this video peace